Hmm? Finally. Hmm? I thought for a second you would never wake up, little one. How ironic that would have been, would it not? I'm Karen. Well, that is what I have been until your arrival. I cannot say that I am sad to leave. We still have a few things left to do here. I'm afraid you'll have to pick up things where I left them. It is, after all, my very last day. And you are... Stella. Welcome, Stella. I see you've brought a friend here with you. What's his name? I see. You too will share the burden then. And, uh, and take it over from me. As I said, in a few minutes I will be gone from this world. And this is what here. You will be the new spirit for me. Listen. Your task here will be far from easy, but simple nonetheless. Go fetch the stray spirits stranded on the islands, and when they are ready, bring them back here. Dying souls can't pass away on their own. You will have to help them fulfill their last requests and be at their service until the last break. The big round bridge over there is the Ever Door. Alpha where everything starts, the Omega where everything ends. This is where all the quests get, com get completed and where existence meets its threshold. There is no task more important than this one. Stella. Never forget this, Stella. Here, there is something I need to give you. Now, be, re be really careful with it. It is the Everlight, a symbol of your status here, and the only tool you will ever need. Mm. Wait, what are you? Mm. Oh, how highly inappropriate. Mm. Well, that settles. Everlight. The Everlight will help you throughout your trip. It will be the light that shines in the darkness, the last remaining hope of the departed. Listen. Hope is a flame. The light that never falters, the beacon of et eternity. It is heavy and inconvenient, but there is no greater duty than this one. The fate of lost souls rests on your shoulders. Look, I was overwhelmed too at first. Just try to keep your focus. Take it one step at a time. You will soon get used to this place. Accustomed to these moments. You are the new spirit fit, after all. Just one thing. Once I am gone, you will have to find a ship of your own. Mine is not suitable, and it will fade away once I am gone. You might find one not too far from here, if you keep rowing in the right direction for some time. Probably. It's time. Here I go. Bye -bye. Go long, Stella, and good luck. You will need it. Welcome to the Spirit Fire.
like apparently I get about uh, getting dead people to in their end. This must jump, okay. Hold. Yes, and space. Okay. What do we talk? Enter. Mm -hmm. Stella! It really is you. Stand up straight and let me get a look at you. Mm -hmm. You look good. And Baffledil is here too, I see. Mm -hmm. We'll have a final end roll then. Ah, it might not be that obvious after all. Mm -hmm. It's me. When? Good thing you found me. Mm -hmm. But if you're here, it means. Oh. You are the new spirit far. Mm -hmm. You are the one replacing Karen. I was trying to get rid of him and only ended up here by accident. I've been stuck on this disgusting island for about a week, living off sardines and cigarettes. Mm -hmm. yeah, funny how I used to be the one getting you out of trouble before. I guess you have an Everlight now. Mm -hmm. Of course. Is that boat over there? Mm -hmm. That's the one. Mm -hmm. It's obviously slightly shabby, but let's commandeer it. I'll wager it will work, since you're the spirit fire. Okay, meet me on the deck over there. Mm -hmm. I'll explain it all. So we can use something, it blows. Uh. Mm -hmm. Okay, here goes. I hope my fur coat won't be too damaged. Not want to jump for joy, but this feels good. Much better than anticipated. Mm -hmm. Oh, the way I see it, this boat is yours now. Don't you think? Mm -hmm. Good. And as you, the spirit fire, welcoming stray spirits is your new job. And once aboard, they will assume their true forms. Mm -hmm. But it's my theory, anyway. Why are you looking like me, Dad? Mm -hmm. You need to come here and give me a hug. Now, let's take a look at this chaos. Can I walk somehow? Mm -hmm. No. Mm -hmm. What a mess. Reminds me of old Petunia's old yard. A beautiful, unorganized testament to someone's laziness. Mm -hmm. Or a vital impossibility to get rid of anything. At any rate, we should do something about this. Oh, my best orders will be back. Let me think. Mm -hmm. There's only one way to clean this up. We have to meet Albert. Mm -hmm. He's a local shipwright. And his jokes are garbage. But he's the only one who can fix your boat. Mm -hmm. We should head to Albert's shipyard. You must be wondering how to make the ship move. Mm -hmm. It's really easy, actually. There, let me give you the key I found on the island. It will unlock that cabin in the back. Mm -hmm. You should find a map projector in there. How do I know all this? Well, I was planning on escape, remember? Mm -hmm. And you know me, I plan things meticulously. Very mm -hmm. meticulously. So, open up the cabin star. Mm -hmm. Map projector should be simple enough to use, and you just have to go to Albert's shipyard. Okay, that was a, bit too, a little bit too much for the explanation. We have a quest and who this quest belongs to. Good, 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 good. And there's our bed with multiple clocks. Mm. Yeah. This is the other door. Pass. So I guess this is the shipyard. Hello! Mm -hmm. 
I understand, the ship is powered by Everlight. That's how it crews the ocean and reveals the stray spirits. It also explains why I couldn't do anything by myself. Mm -hmm. you, must not, you must admit, it's quite fascinating. Look, I know you must feel overwhelmed. Mm -hmm. Aaron, the Evador, the Spirit Furs, this place, this boat, me being here? It's a lot. You must be wondering on what's this go what is mm -hmm. going on. Truth be told, I don't know anymore either. But I'm here for you. I'll do my best to help you and try to make sense of it all. Mm -hmm. As I said earlier, I wanted to live by myself, but somehow I just couldn't. Now that I see you, I think I know why. I'll give you some space for now. Don't hesitate to explore this ship. Mm -hmm. You can even give that fishing rod a try. The world is your oyster. We can fish. We can fish. Great. Using the ever. Okay. Oh, we've got a fish! Just this one, and we can go explore the ship. We are, as I can see. Hey, of course, there's an old ship. Okay. Go out. It's. I won't give you. You. Okay. You are nearly the best. You, I don't know what you like. I don't know what you dislike. Let's give you some. Then some no items of whistle. Hmm. Interesting. That's how you. Seriously. That's why I know nothing about you, even though we are, we are supposed to know you. Okay. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I thought we can. Oh! Look at our ship while sitting on the couch. Here we are! Mm -hmm. Now head down to Albert's shipyard and upgrade your blueprint station. It's the only way to clear the clutter. I'm curious about what it all made of. Mm -hmm. It's all made of. Was it doing the smell? I would say at least seven different types of dirt and dust. Over here. Welcome to my shipyard, young traveler. <laughs> Who are my prices are our customer's best friend. I'm Albert. Been in the business for shipbuilding or for ages. Should I assume you are the new spirit fur? Well, of course you are. Anyway, you've been able to start this ship and bring it here after all. Gwen was right to point you towards my humble enterprise. <laughs> Let me see what you have here. <laughs> nice dinghy. By now it looks exactly like the one I will build some time ago and stored in my old shipyard. See, Karen wasn't happy about this gloomy and dunk arc. Actually, he was always complaining about everything. But the customer's always right. So I built him a newer, better one. Of course, he would never abandon his previous boat. His old habits die hard. But don't worry, you can keep this one. Let's just call this alone. And let me tell you something. You know we always joke about the construction here, eh? Don't worry, we are still working on it. Ah, 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 ah. Anyway, with a little bit of love, this bird will be re resplendent again. The first thing you'll need is a proper blueprint table. Since it's, since it's your lucky day and I'm feeling generous, I'll offer it to you. Free of charge! Mind you, if it's just a bit bare bones in terms of function functionality. But the subsequ subsequent upgrades will come at such a small price you want to buy them almost immediately. Simply direct me to upgrade the ship. This upgrade. Yep. Okay. You'll be able to build and edit your buildings on your boats. What a treat! <laughs> but if you really want to work with your boat in size and pleasure, I'm your guy. Come back when you feel your boat is getting too crowded. Cheers! Thank you. 
Mm -hmm. Finally. Mm -hmm. Good. Albert gave it to you for free. And he said he loaned the ship to you. Mm -hmm. Aminas. Hard to know what he has in mind, but it doesn't sound reassuring. Anyway, let's focus on the task at hand for now. Mm. Hang up this deck. You can go to your new blueprint table above your cabin and select the move option. In it, you'll be able to remove any building and get back resources. Mm. Go for it, I'll wait down here. Yep, so we'll try. Select. Salvage. Yep. Oh, no. oh. Mm -hmm. Wonderful. Mm -hmm. You did a wonderful job, Stella. And the good news is that you have enough resources to add a guest house to your ship. Unnecessary amenity. Mm -hmm. The only way to spirits such as myself will have to borrow a place to relax and sleep. Well, sleep, not really. I can tell you for sure that no one will be thrilled to spend more than one night in there. Mm -hmm. But it beats sleeping on the deck. The stars are pretty, but the wood is st stiff and the humidity is hard to tolerate. I'll leave it to you. Have fun! We need to buy it from him, right? I once had a friend who cut his own toe. He had a new, a new one made of rubber. He was called Roberto. Get it? Yeah. <laughs> nope. So we can get anything. I thought we could get this. Oh my. You don't have anything to say, and it wasn't necessary for me to come back here. Sure. Oh, we can go from here. <laughs> There's a field. Oh, we can build a field. Garden. Kitchen. Okay. And here we can get by ourselves a guest house. Yeah. And this over there. So we don't have. Oh, we can only build one of these. Mm -hmm. Very nice. Mm -hmm. This guest house is very pretty. It has your touch. Nice work, as usual. Mm -hmm. Now, at last, I have a place to sit down and enjoy the view. Oh, uh, wait, mm -hmm. what is going on? Something else is happening. Mm -hmm. Oh, I should have expected this. I'm actually hungry. Mm -hmm. Very hungry. You know how terrible a cook I am, but I remember you being absolutely fantastic at it. Mm -hmm. And you might have fished a few fishes already. To be honest, I can't really eat on an entire raw fish. I could try for sure, but I'll probably choke on the fishbone and never survive. Mm -hmm. This That's not how you want me to go. As absurd as it sounds. So you should keep on using this blueprint table for yours and build a kitchen aboard. Mm -hmm. I'm pretty sure I've seen the plans for it in here, as well as the necessary resources. Yeah, you're quite bright, Jelly. Mm. There's only one way, only one way to get some. The... Mm -hmm. Look, I should have told you when I first met you here. Something scares the hell out of me. Mm -hmm. a dark presence and even eye cover from a void that swallows all, light included. It can take many forms and from. Always jellyfish. Mm. Yes, I'm fully aware of the irony. <laughs> the bright jelly you need for the kitchen, well, only these jellyfish can provide it to you. So there's no other option. Mm. I have to face my fears. But you're here. Mm. With you, I can do it. It will appear as a dark patch of pure fear on your map, so you can't miss it. Oh, I'll take some time to prepare myself. Oh, and we can actually see her. if she moves, we can see her. There. That's very nice touch. Very nice touch. This is a patch of fear. Crates. Okay, let's go for crates first. Mm. 
Hey. Okay. Never mind then. I want to give you a act to make you braver, but you're like this. A very nice wallpaper right there. All in all, this game looks amazing. Oh, hello. How does it even work? I'm not having. Okay. Is it like a life force that wants. that everything won't consume you around here? Okay, we'll have. Can we make it two? Yes, we're not missing, really missing anything because I went for the credits. So can I go down? Yes, I know where we are. I just don't know how to interact with it. Space back today. Nothing? Okay, what about here? Okay, we need that. I think there's another crate over here. Nope. Nope. Just that one crate and the diving spot. Now we can go to the patch of nightmares. At night. If they are really luminous jellyfishes, it should look amazing. So, unless they are not all stuff nightmares. We should get there before sunrise. I hope. Not quite sure how the day cycle works here. Just sticks. One space at a time. Anyway, let's see. Maybe we can buy build something? Buy something? Nope. Here we are. Yeah. Here they come. Remember, set your eyes on the ones with bright jelly. Mm -hmm. They should be visible enough. Let's say to pop as many as you can. You'll get a glimpse anyway. I will wait for you inside. It's just too hard for me to stay out here. Mm -hmm. Okay, go ahead. I believe in you. Pop them. Okay. Well, as long as they are here, I can try. Okay. Not really. Wait. Wait. Oh no. I didn't know. Okay, we can't get everyone. Maybe we should have stayed.
Okay, I can always just hide. How much do we need? Because that's a lot. I know I miss a lot as well, but... Oop, get over here. Okay, looks like we have enough. Ooh, fantastic. Okay, I'm really impressed. We rocked out there, humbling and diving like a shooting star. And without the slightest fear, no hesitation at all. You definitely haven't lost your touch, Stella. And you even gathered enough bright jelly to build a proper kitchen. Go for it. I'll be patiently waiting. Slowly digesting myself. You are such a drama queen. Oh. Okay, so apparently space bar is also way out. Okay. There has to be a way from oh. Okay. I like that. Mm -hmm. Lovely kitchen. I know, I believe myself. Mm -hmm. You can now use the kitchen's oven. It should be rather simple. Put any one ingredient in the oven and wait for it to be cooked. Mm -hmm. You can even try these loose corn kernels that have been hanging around my pockets. I can't wait to see you in your cooking glory again. You got this. Mm -hmm. Thanks. Okay, let's okay, we know no receipts. Mm -hmm. Give me a second. Um, corn is golden grain with lots of different uses. Somehow, corn you can be ground into corn flour in, in a windmill. Okay. Uh, make it popcorn. Hey, hey, you got this? Okay. Yep, popcorn. Look, another one. The herring. I really hope we can't burn it. I think the clock shows how long we have to wait for it to be ready. Okay, okay, I get it. And after we feed our friend, I think it'd be a good place to get a little pause. Grab some tea. Um, and maybe some to find something to it. Yeah, sounds good. Oh, animation in this game is great. Especially the cats. Grilled fish. Okay, simple. And let's see. There's some pepper wood. Okay, we can we can cook wood, and it will take a long time. So let's talk to Stella. A uh, tooth. Mm -hmm. ah. Yes. I want to tell you about this. Mm -hmm. As you can see, this boat stops at night. I believe it's a side effect of your everlight being well light. Or some other technicality? Mm. That being said, it will allow people to sleep undisturbed. You in the meantime can do anything you want. Tackle unfinished business or just chill on the deck on the house. I'd suggest you go to sleep too. In the cozy little room atop your cabin. Mm. You wake up refreshed and ready to go. And this ship will start up again in the morning. Oh, and talking about that. You know me. Waking up on the time has never been my fault. Mm. And ring the bell over there to wake you up. Remember, only do it at the right time. Mm -hmm. Early morning you should do the trick. Speaking of which, time for me to take a nap. See you tomorrow, Stella. Mm -hmm. Have a good night. Okay, so have a good night. And that's gonna be it. Oh, it's just halfway there. Uh, that is gonna be it for today. So for now, thank you very much. Stay alive and see you soon. Bye!